Hi guys, Candy Toy Box here. Today you will need some perler beads. I have about two feet of string, one pony bead, scissors, and a needle. And you could use pony beads for this, but you would have to use less beads. And I love this technique. I feel like it's way easier than the traditional way to make a ladder bracelet. But you guys will have to let me know. I've already made two of them. <laughs> I can't, I can't stop. And these glow in the dark, which is cool too. So you're going to start with putting your pony bead on one end and then tying it. And you want to leave a little bit of string. Because you're going to have to tie it at the end. So... You just tie it on there once and leave a little bit of string. And put your needle on. We're going to put two pink, two orange, two yellow, and two blue. Okay, you're going to do that nine times. I'm going to go ahead and do that, that part off camera, and then I'll be back to show you what the next step. Okay, guys, I have all my beads on. I have nine sets of the rainbow, and this is what it should look like. Now, what you're going to do is we need to tighten this a little bit, so you're going to grab this string and pull pull down to get this this part right here a little tighter and you're gonna have to hold this tight as you're working until you get this going so what you're gonna do is take this and place it backward and we're going to take our needle down these two yellow. So we're kind of making like a circle. And you're going to pull. We're pulling this string down here. And then you're going to take your hand and pull and hold that string. You want it to stay tight. Now we're going to move this backwards. And you're going to take your needle and go through these two orange. And we're going to take this and go backwards. So you're basically going back and forth, back and forth. And you're going to take your needle and go down the, the two pink. Moving this back. And we're going to go up the two blue. We're going to go down these two yellow. Okay. We're just going back and forth. I'm going to go ahead and do that till we get to the end here, and then I'll show you how to tie it off. Okay, guys, I have 
all my sets on. This is what it looks like. You're going to remove this bead. So you have two strings here. And you're going to take your needle and go through these two blue. Okay, and then these ends should line up together and you just tie it. Yeah, let me know if you guys find this easier than the traditional way. I think it is once you get it started and get comfortable. I really enjoyed making these and I can't wait to make more like this. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. See you next time.